Hey guys, welcome back to another Sunday talk. I am doing this early just because I have a lot of things to do later and I'm like, let me get this out this way. So if you haven't yet, please subscribe. Don't forget to do that right now and go ahead and click that button for me. Awesome and amazing if you haven't yet. But if you have, thank you for subscribing. And today we're just going to be talking about what's been going on. And it's Sunday. So right now in Colorado, it is snowing. Yes, your girl is out here. In the snow, I figure it's more peaceful. And being inside, I'm not saying inside not peaceful. It's just, you know, nice to just take a breather from the kids and taking care of my mom. And I just, and I'm making lasagna tonight. So that's going to be yummy, hopefully. And yeah. All right, sorry about the mess. I'm back. But here's the snow. Oh, you guys can see the snow coming down. But yeah, my car's in the front right now, but I'm going to bring it in after I finish this Sunday talk with you guys. So, starting off with, hope you have your coffee, wine, juice, whatever you like to get this talking going. As I have mine, it's um, Aramis Strawberry Mango. Nothing too, too bad. But um, I am going to, uh, let's just do it. So, I'm so, all right. So you know the Passover is coming and I'm getting ready for that. So I have cleaned the kitchen. Yeah, I, I cleaned the kitchen. I just need to do under the table, the other side table that, that like we have and clean that area up, then I'm done. Um, what else? I have the kids do the front room. So yeah, I'm trying to get everything nice and neat and just start cleaning. I guess you can call it somewhat spring cleaning, but not really. We're just trying to clean for the Passover starts because we want to be cleansed um take out the old and bring in the new i am just you know fresh start um like i said in my other talk my other sunday talk on my late night talk you can always go back and look at that but you know i gave you some exodus deuteronomy another one so i see my kids coming out I'm like no this is my sunday talk or like my mom but anyways, uh, but yeah, so that's going on. Yeah, to come out. Hold on. All right, guys, let's get back to this video. Sorry about that. Yeah, let's have my hood on now because it's cold. But um, but yeah. So if you want to know more, you can look check out my other video that I did talk about, um, and also the challenge. The challenge went well. I think I told you guys that already. Channel remember what video. I think I did another late night talk. I told you guys about that or whatever. So a new challenge is actually I don't have one because I'm gonna be doing the Passover and taking out the eleven out the house. So that's gonna be fun for eight days eating no bread, nothing that has eleven in it. So that's gonna be fun. I'm trying to actually find a cabin in Estes Park or hotel or something so me and my family can enjoy Estes Park in the summertime. And, well springtime see how that goes and then I'm trying to figure out another trip that we can all take um, probably in November time so maybe in the beginning of, of November we sell Chelsea and yeah right now I'm just trying to stay focused on my kids school I hope we're going back to um, trying to get that in the works what else uh, yeah it's being responsible my own adult here. I don't sorry I don't have any scriptures for you to this Sunday talk because just because I was um actually in Estes Park and we were looking for different places that we might either rent out or stop by and see or um also collect some information that we can do with the family when they come down here. Maybe we might go to Denver, I don't know, maybe Thornton or Westminster, I'm not for sure yet where we're we going, but I'll try to take pictures and blog as well with the family or just show you what we we have been doing and uh, yeah so hope everybody's having a blessed sunday it's freezing out here maybe i should do my time and talk inside <sighs> but the fresh air smells so good and yeah and it's snowing and it's beautiful and it's great to go sit out here and think so yeah um <laughs> my mom's funny she's like so you have a little boyfriend yet i was like wow mom really really <laughs> I was like, no, I don't have a boyfriend. Because she was seeing if I wanted to take somebody with me to go up at the Essex Park. Just because I'll basically be by myself. The only one without anybody, but it's okay. I guess, yeah, it's okay. 
it's fine. Um, I get to explore nature and, and um, just enjoy my time. And maybe never know. Um, I might meet somebody or, hey, somebody want to go out to the park with me? Let me know. Call me. <laughs> it's playing. But um, anyways, yeah. So I'm going to go ahead and sip on my drink. My little wine. And enjoy it. Until next time, I am going to try my best to just be calm for the next two months because we have a lot going on and I cannot wait for school to be over at number one. Number two, I can't wait to find a place downtown Nessus Park, somewhere around it. And number three, I am can't wait for what to come. I'm trying to plan things out, trying to get things done. So hopefully we can talk more about that right now. I'm just right now I don't have everything set, but I'm hoping good things come my way. So don't forget to read your Bibles, get in the Word, you know. I've been struggling with that a little bit, but I'm trying to get back to that. So yeah, I will hopefully talk to you guys before the Unleavened Bread starts and show you what we do for Unleavened Feast Day. And yeah, you guys take care and shalom and thank you for watching. And another video will be coming because we went to Essex Park yesterday so i'm still trying to edit that video i'm still gonna go put in it not put in it so yes yeah, all choppy and stuff so bear with me with that one all right take care and shalom yeah.